Hello everyone, welcome back to more Nintendo News. Uh, today's stories are... Yes, Satoru Iwata has been re-elected as Nintendo's president. Um, let's play Hail to the Chief, I guess. Da, 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 da. Did he have to do a campaign to be re-elected, I wonder, like regular presidential candidates? Um, but any, all silliness aside, uh, the Nintendo annual shareholders meeting of Nintendo m met last a couple days ago, and the shareholders had re-elect Satoru Iwata. Iwata's current pr approval rating hasn't been announced, but we'll probably find out shortly. Now, uh, Satoru Iwata wasn't able to attend the uh, the meeting itself because he ha has had medical problems, so, and we'll just leave it at that. Uh, hopefully he gets better, but and hopefully he will be able to do more things to bring Nintendo into... I guess back into relevancy, if that's a word, or if, if, if even that's the uh, the term. And maybe because right now Nintendo is going through this uh, slump, I guess, if, if for lack of a better word. But uh, the next story actually kind of trumps what I just said because Mario Kart 8 has reportedly been had sold eight two million copies of the game. So. so that's really good. That's that'll definitely help Nintendo for sure get back out of their slump, and uh, hopefully they will be able to make more games like Mario Kart 8 that will be able, or at least that will sell as well as Mario Kart 8 has in the in this last month. And uh, finally, there's been more screenshots for Hyrule Warriors. These ones show off Zant. And more Agatha and Liana. Or no, not Liana. Lana! <laughs> so yeah, there's, there's a picture of Zant and, and Agatha and Lana. And they have a little bit of a this character description for Agatha and Lana and how they fit into the story. As well as Zant. So if you... I think I'm going to read them. And uh, if you guys don't want to hear them, a spoiler alert kind of thing, and I guess... Click off the video now, or we'll skip it to the end, but uh, here, I'll start reading them now. So, Agatha is returning from The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess, and she is a young girl who collects golden insects, and she lost her way from another world. She's attacked by monsters, but is saved by Lana, who is searching for the door of reincarnation. Now, Agatha is a natural airhead, and does any, any, everything at her own pace. Her atmosphere is generally warm, and she is always smiling. In addition to her parasol, she can fire giant beetles at her enemies, as well as fly in the sky on the back of a gigantic butterfly. Now, Lana is a white witch who can manipulate powerful magic. She has a lively and honest personality, and puts all, her all into everything that she does. For the good of all her high rule, she decided to help put an end to the misconduct of the game's main antagonist, Saya. She and Saya have some sort of connection, but uh, she doesn't go into it at this point. In battle, she does a lot of j running and jumping and making her fighting style dynamic. Now, Zant is a man to have ruled the shadows with a powerful force snatched away from royalty. He was summoned by Saya from another world via the door of reincarnation. At first, he might appear c composed, but he is actually considerably hysterical and bizarre. He wields two curved swords, which he slashes recklessly in combat, and has a body slam attack that does damage across a wide area. He is also well off in magic-based attacks. So those are the three... Those are the... Description for those three characters, and yeah, it's neat that they're bringing in other characters from other games into Hyrule Warriors, and it'll make for an exciting gameplay experience. And I wonder if you guys are hyped for it. We have been doing a lot of stories on Hyrule Warriors too, so let me know if you need me to do something else. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next episode of Nintendo News. Bye bye for now.
Hello, and this is the end card, where I, you have a couple things to click on. To the left are three different LPs I'm working on, Project Cross Zone, Dylan's Rolling Western, and Pokemon X. And yeah, you can check me out on my uh, social media on the left. Thank you guys so much for watching, and bye-bye.